If you want your booty held, like, uh, if you want your booty to be held or to for pants to hold it, this is it. Look at this. Look at this. I literally felt like I put my butt into like a cup. Hey guys, so I received this product called Teamy and this is their wellness protein. It is the triple berry wellness protein. I have been using it for the past week now and it's just been helping me build a lot of muscle mass, especially because summer is coming up soon. So I started taking protein and it has 17 grams of protein in it, which is amazing. And it comes with a tumbler. The tumbler, I got the coral color because I think it's super cute. Great things about the tumbler is that if you open it, you have a strainer. So if you want to do a tea instead of like a protein powder, this is here for you. This is a bottom compartment that the tea me tumbler has and you can put extra protein powder in here if needed or tea. So I'm going to show you how I make my protein powders before I go to the gym and this is it. So. Open this, I don't need the strainer because I'm making a protein powder. Open my protein powder. I usually like to do half a scoop um, of the spoon. Goes in here. Take about a cup of water. Again, no need for the strainer. Close it up. The really good thing about this is that you have no spillage when shaking it, which is also great because nobody wants that. Another amazing thing is its handle. So it's a quick, like, if you're going to a gym, you can hold on to it easily. And then, yeah, opens up like this. And it tastes pretty good too. Good morning guys. So I decided I was gonna try and do a vlog for my YouTube channel. Pause. Let's pause real quick. Okay, yes. We can see my eyebrows. We know it looks jacked up, but one thing you guys are not gonna do is make fun of my eyebrows because I'm gonna have them done. I'm gonna have them done this week, but I just have to wait because it needs to be fresh. Like it just needs to be fresh for my birthday week. So yeah. I'm gonna have it done. It's looking like whatever it's looking like right now. However, when I do have makeup on, it looks good because I know how to conceal, hide, and do all that. But it will be done for my birthday, period. Which is exactly what I'm gonna do. Um, I'm just gonna start today. Yesterday, I went for my friend's birthday party. It was a lot of fun, but I was rushing and I really couldn't, oh crap. I was rushing and I really, my sister's called me, but I was rushing and I really couldn't put my wig on like while filming because it would look horrible, but I was able to put it on um, and do my makeup really quick, but it wasn't like the amount of makeup I would have loved to do. It was just like a quick like foundation throw on and let's go. So um, I'm gonna try to vlog, I'm going to try to vlog today and um this weekend hopefully um and then i also got a package from sheet in i'm also gonna do that go go through with you guys like what i got and because i got some workout stuff and i'm super super excited about it because summer is here baby and you better you better get your shit tight and right but um another thing i wanted to talk to you guys about was my nails my nails are ratchet under these these are press on nails and i'm telling you without press on nails i would be crying right now and um that's because my nail appointment is on tuesday my birthday is coming up and i don't want to get my nails done way too like ahead of time and have it like not look you know, you know when fresh nails just look fresh. Yeah, I need my nails fresh for my birthday, period. So this is like a cover-up for now 
till um till I get my nails done for my birthday. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Um, I think this this is a really cute color. I think press on nails might be the next thing because if you think about it, like acrylic and powder dip, like if it breaks, it breaks. But as soon as this one pops up, take your glue out your bag. Put it on a new one and place it back on and it's like a fresh set so i don't know they just gotta make more designs so whoever is making press on nails i need you to get your shit together but anyways i'm gonna go hop into a shower and then you guys are gonna get ready with me and um yeah and then we're, i'm gonna film today hopefully i will this is my first vlog but i'm going to try because why not why the hell not but yeah let me call my sister back and hop into the shower Oh. <laughs> babe the video deleted so we were talking about a video that i had recorded and how it had like automatically deleted on its own but basically my neighbor was like naked in the background because the way i filmed it like it could sh i was sitting on the couch and you know the background is my view and i didn't know because i wasn't facing that way my neighbor was just like naked like you couldn't clearly see it but you could see uh, just skin and all of a sudden the video is gone so for that um vlog i actually didn't like you know i wasn't gonna put it on like youtube but it was just weird that the video randomly de deleted on its own oh, yeah. it like deleted out of nowhere so this is my quick wig method which is just using the got to be spray and the hair dryer so I wouldn't use this if I was gonna like let's say go to the club or go to somewhere where it's heavily crowded where there is humidity or you would get into the water. If I was to do that, then I would use bold hold because I know then my wig would be secured. But since I'm not doing any of that and it's just chill brunch, I can just do a quick wig. Angels be calling, none of that could ever make me leave. Every time I look into your eyes, I see it. Your life. Every time I get a bit of sound, I feel it. Down. 
So once I'm done with the Got To Be spray, the next thing I'm going to do is to take a rag, some soap and water and just wipe off any of that like residue because obviously I don't want my face to be shiny because Got To Be spray can make your face shiny. So I just use the rag, wipe it off and that's it. my makeup and my hair is not done it's not set i'm not leaving the house period i don't care if it's not good if it's not up to the point where i need it to be i'm just not like i can't i'm gonna be upset i'm gonna be upset i'm literally gonna be upset that's on period so yeah so let's now that my hair is laid well, I still gotta straighten it. I'm still gonna, like, look. I'm gonna straighten it and all that. But um, let's go ahead and start with my makeup. I don't, see, there's so many makeup artists on YouTube. Like, their stuff is what you need to be watching. But you're here. No, <laughs> just kidding. But yeah, um, it's gonna be quick. It's not like, I don't really have much to say when I'm doing my makeup. If you guys don't know, my eyebrows are microbladed because I, apparently I was born as a naked mole rat and I have no hair anywhere. They look really bad right now because they haven't been um, cleaned up. So they're like all over the place. That's actually how my natural eyebrows look, which is crazy. But it's like microblading makes it more visible as to like where it is. So I usually clean it up myself. But since um, I'm waiting to clean them up, I'm going to go to like my lady who always does my eyebrows um, to clean it up for me. So yeah, um, yep. So this is my um, my Becca Ever Matte or I'm just kidding, Ever Matte Poreless Primer, primer, basically my primer, because I have serious oily skin, so. So I'm done with my makeup, hair's laid, everything's laid. I just wish these would like stay down, but yeah. So I'm about to get dressed right now. And I'll see you guys when I'm done. I need to put some jewelry on, but yeah. Okay, so we are late obviously because of me, um, but I had a hard time choosing an outfit for brunch. It wasn't supposed to be anything like really huge. Cause Actually, it was a huge deal because the brunch was set to be a formal brunch and either wear white or black. I didn't know that because I didn't read the invitation all the way through. So here I was pulling up at brunch like, oh shit, it's formal. Yeah. But the good thing is, out of nowhere, I did wear black and white. So, ain't that crazy? It's brunch, but yeah, um, it just took me a while. But yeah, this is my makeup, my hair. I basically have like a black satin top on and um, my favorite zebra pants. Um, I don't know if you guys can see it. Oh, it's not gonna hit me. Good morning, guys. This is the next morning. I um I overslept. I was supposed to be up around seven, but we stayed um we stayed at my friend's house longer than we should have. But it was fun. I loved it. We had a really good time. Um, of course, we had to. We weren't supposed to, but we got McDonald's, like, at the end of the night. And um, we're supposed to be on a diet. So, I don't know about that, but we need to start going back to the gym. But, yeah. Um, 
today I have quite a few things to do. I have to, um, I have to go, let me see. I should make a list because honestly, it is way too much. But I know I need to do try on from my sheet and stuff. They came in yesterday. Oh, I still got boogers in my eye. Oh my gosh. I need to wash my face. Number one, I need to wash my face. Wash my face first. Um, I know I need to do a try on haul. I'm gonna film that. I need to go pick up a couple stuff from Zara that I ordered online and it had to be shipped to the store close by to me. So I need to pick that up. I bought the same thing in like two different sizes cause I didn't know which size would fit me first. I didn't know which size would fit me best. So I'm gonna do that. And um, I know I have a couple of deliveries that I need to pick up. I have a lot of, I'm gonna be having a lot of delivery this week for my coming up birthday. I just hope they come on time before my trip. But yeah, so um, that's the stuff I'm gonna do today. I'm gonna take you guys with me. So yeah, all right. Okay, so um, I just got to the mall. At first, I went to Walmart because um, I had to go get, like, I went to Walmart because I needed to get a cloth that I wanted to get made into pants for me, but that cloth is gone. Someone bought it, and I know I should have gotten it the first time I saw it, but I was like, oh, like, what would I be using it for? And, like, throughout the week, I was like, ooh, I could make it into some cute summer pants, and now it's gone, so that's dead. I tried to go to the beauty supply store to get um, concealer and some lashes, but they're closed because it's Easter. And then, but I was, I was able to get my um, my car parts from Advanced Auto Parts. I always order it online, and um, I just pick it up from the store because I buy my parts myself. Because mechanics be overcharging people. But um, yeah, like I buy my own parts and then I just pay for labor. But yeah, let's go into the mall. I just parked. I found parking, which is like hard to do. It's so, literally living in the DC, Virginia area is so hard with parking, but I found parking. And your parallel parking skills has to be on point or else you're not gonna survive it here. You're literally not, but. Anyways, let's go into the mall. Go try on some clothes. <laughs> and yeah. I'm out of Zara. Um, got my package. I was originally supposed to pick up only two things, but that didn't happen. I ended up buying two more items because I just thought they were cute. But um, I'm gonna go home, try them on, see if it fits. Anything that doesn't fit, gets returned tomorrow so and the sheet and stuff so i'm gonna try the sheet and stuff today so yeah let's go home so you guys i'm gonna show you my um sheet and home first thing i got was um this set these shorts and this top i don't know if you guys can see it but yeah, let me try it on. So here's the first um, workout outfit from Shein. This is super cute. Look at this. It make the booty look good. I love this color. I'm so glad I opted out for the orange because I was really scared about um, bright colors, but this is so cute. The fabric, oh. It's such good quality. It's so soft. Let me show you guys. The back, it's a set basically. So yeah. Sorry, I'm looking a little bit crazy because I just woke up from my nap. But yeah, after all that running around, I had to sleep, get myself together. So yeah, this is the first one. This is the second outfit. Um. These pants were a little bit tight, but they fit. Um, like these little black um, lines, I'm trying to stand so you guys can see it, can make it a little bit tight, but um, trying to tiptoe, but they fit. 
But yeah. So this is the second outfit from Shein. I really like this one. It's pants instead of like short. The pants are a little bit too tight around here. Um, I think, I don't know, the crotch area, like I wish it could go a little bit more up. See, like look, I'm not trying to break a nail, but that's a lot of crotch area. I wish it could go a little bit more up, maybe because it's a bit tight. Top part, a little bit loose, you know. But yeah, too cute. I still like the orange one better. I need to buy more of the orange one. That's what I need to buy in different colors. Especially since it's summer, it's gonna be, I could be wearing shorts to the gym. But yeah, this is it. So I took off my scarf. My scarf keep, my scarf, my scarf kept falling off. Here's the third sheet in gym wear. I love this material. It's so comfortable. It's the same material that the first one that I tried on, the orange one, is made from. And it's just like, it's really airy and breathable. So I don't know what type of material it is, but this, like, if I'm buying gym stuff from now on, this is the material I'm getting. This pants feel more comfortable than the black one because of this material, it's like, again, this breathable material. My sports bra on, it holds your titties well. It also has a pad, that's the other thing. The thing I didn't mention is that all the, um, all the tops, the workout tops have like a bra pad, which is really good because it like gives you comfort. It gives you a good place for your titties to sit. So I like that a lot. But this is the third one. This color is also nice. I don't know about how it's going to hide sweat marks because when I work out, obviously I sweat. So there's going to be a lot of sweat showing. But we'll see about that. This is the fourth workout set. I love this dark color. This dark color is like, it's really good with heart hiding sweat marks. Um, it says love all around so if you turn around it, there's like a cutout like right here and it goes all the way down to my ankle the issue with this jumpsuit is that there's no support for your breast like at all like none at all um the reason why my titties are sitting up because they're small titties but there is no support for your breast so like for me if i was to wear this and run I would need to put a sports bra on, which is unfortunate. But I mean, if I, I it's so weird because like if I put a sports bra on, let me see if in the back. Well, it depends on how my sports bra fit, but still like I just wish I had more support. But maybe this is not for like, you know, a super active day, maybe for like a stretch day or a yoga day. So, but. I still need to wear a bra with this one just to protect my babies so they're not like flouncing everywhere if I'm moving. So uh, this jumpsuit, I got it in this pink color. I just wanted something bright for the gym. Um, it does show everything so you can see like even my little pudge, it's showing. So yeah, um, I don't know how I feel about it. I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to keep it if, or if I'm going to return it. It's very comfortable, though. Very stretchy. Again, I think it might be the same material. No, it's not. Actually, never mind. It's not the same material as the first one. That first material is really soft. This is more on of like a stretchy type of that material. It's not as soft, but I don't know. I like it, yet I don't. trying to figure out what it is maybe i need to pull this up more see but that looks weird maybe i need to actually mm, pull it down but then it fits weird i don't know maybe i just have a short torso this might work better for someone with a longer torso a little bit too big like the straps in the back 
trying to find a way to wear this, but huh? see this crisscross thing. Uh, it's just weird. I don't know about this one. I might return it. I'm gonna see how much it costs to return first before I decide. But uh, yeah, if you want your booty held, like uh, if you want your booty to be held or to for pants to hold it this is it look at this look at this i literally felt like i put my butt into like a cup both of my ass cheeks into a cup look at this but i don't know these pants just makes your booty big like what <laughs> I don't know what she and is making, but they making some booty holding pants for real. Look at this. I love this color, first of all. I saw this tan color and I was, is it tan or mauve? No, let me just say it's tan. This tan color and I was like, ooh, I have to get this. But I didn't know that the way this design is, my butt would be held like this. <laughs> but... Yeah, the top is just a simple sports bra. I do feel like my booty is being held in these pants. Um, they are comfortable though, like stretch wise. Um, yeah, I'm not complaining, but I've just never experienced that before. Like having my booty been like in a cup of pants. And again, long pants. I only got one set that's short, which is the orange one I showed earlier. And that's it, those are the outfits I got. Okay, so guys, I just finished getting ready for dinner. The last time I saw you guys, we were um, trying on sheet and clothing for the gym. So I did a middle part this time. I took it a little down with my makeup. I feel like I look better when my makeup is not as heavy. Like it was really heavy yesterday, so I took it a little bit down, especially with the lashes. I have these like hoop earrings on, did a middle part. This dress, I love this dress. Oh my God, this is the cutest, well, it's not the cutest dress, but it's a really cool dress. Um, I got it from Pretty Little Thing. I, I think, yep, Pretty Little Thing. And it's like cut this way. So I'm gonna be wearing this for dinner. We're going to be going to Adaz on the river. I um, heard really good things about that place. Well, I read really good things about that place. So we're gonna try that. And I looked at the menu and they have octopus. So I'm super excited for that. Um, but yeah, so this is my outfit. And I'm gonna throw a jacket on because I think it's cold outside. So yeah, I'm gonna see you guys dinner time. <laughs> Babe, I still need your help. Don't play. Why are you hiding? Anyways. We're done with dinner. Dinner was really nice. Um, I would definitely recommend the restaurant. Service was okay, but yeah. I really like this hair as a middle part in state. This is cute. This is cute. So I just have, I know I showed you guys earlier, what dress I had on. I have my misguided leather jacket, which is literally my favorite jacket ever. Ever, ever, ever. Um, only issue about my skirt is that, or my dress, is that it keeps on riding up. And that's not a cute look at all. Babe, can you slow down? I don't know why he's walking fast. 
Come on. Don't do it. So we made it back home. Um, I'm gonna go back upstairs, take my makeup off, take my wig off. Um, I'm gonna try and do some film. Well, I'm gonna try and film like a couple outfits for you guys so I can add it to this vlog or else I feel like the vlog will be super short. So yeah, I'm gonna do that, take my makeup off and that's it for the vlog. I will see you guys in my next vlog. So if you like this video, like, comment, subscribe. Comment, subscribe, I'm just kidding. But yeah, if you like this video, just go ahead and like, comment, subscribe. This is the second outfit I was gonna do. It's this pretty little thing corset. And also, this is a dress. But I, um, I thought it would be cuter as a skirt. And, you know, it's kind of cute. Cute vibes. I don't know. What do you guys think? I don't know. I think it is kind of cute.